Ooh, come on, give us something. Austrian? Center back again, I don't. Ooh, want to watch. Oh, that'll do. Some discard. It's like 10k, surely. Alright. Alright, guys. So I quick sold him. Can't complain about that. In form. I'll take the take the easy 10k. Uh, so after we pulled Kane, had to go with the Mbele SBC, and in our squad also rocking uh, team of the week left back, right backs, and so on uh, later. But they work well between them. They're quite strong. Mbele, good player, makes a load of tackles in the midfield. Uh, very much enjoyed playing with him so far, so hopefully Tottenham pull the socks up. We might see some uh, see some improvements out of him and get a higher rating and some more stat increases. Uh, right, so so there's icon swaps coming in on Friday, um, and what this looks like it'll be is a whole load of challenges that you redeem for tokens, and then you can redeem all those tokens to earn um, an icon swap. Um, now, there's going to have to be many other challenges to do to get a knife, and I'm sure they're going to make it cost a lot. But, new content, very exciting. We we'll look forward to trying this out uh, when it launches on Friday. Also, with this, um, rumours have it that there are going to be no League SBCs this year. Um, now, if this is true, this ruins some plans I had on making easy League SBC profits that are really casual. Really simple to do, um, but it makes me think that they they have to have a use for silver and bronze players. Um, so I'll get into that in a second. Yeah. Um, there's got to be a use. So coupled with the icon SBC or the icon swaps, sorry, um, there's got to be something involving silver and bronze players that make them useful in the game, uh, which makes me think that perhaps we're going to have some challenges where we're using silver and bronze teams uh, to achieve whatever. Um, so with that in mind, I'm thinking bronze and silver players, good bronze and silver players that are cheap have to be worthwhile investments now. Uh, so if you just go onto Footbin, you can see, uh, just list up, here I've got strikers listed, listed by pace that are silver. And I've just run through them uh, and just picked out fast strikers, people who buy fast strikers. That are dirt cheap, and then I've just stocked the club with a few, like one of each, pretty much. If they're worth pittance, they'll sell for pittance. We won't lose anything. Um, but if it, they are needed come Friday, maybe we can make some good money. Um, and also, we'll have some already stocked to make a good team. So I've done this for the silvers already, uh, and I might be tempted to do this for some bronzes. It takes just takes a couple of minutes of searching, uh, smash out some names, smash out a few quick buys. Uh, and yeah, we'll sit them in the club and see if that's worth anything to us. I hope it is. Uh, it'd be really good if we did. Um, so yeah, so on to our purchases for the week. The As you can see, we've started smashing out some silvers. Pacey silvers, there's a whole host of bids on them at the moment. Um, but actual copper safe investments, rather than this, which is a bit of a gamble, um, is cheap, around discard, cheap uh, team of the weeks that are going out packs. So they got our packs on like Wednesday, so they're as cheap as they're going to get now. They're in as high supply as they're going to get. Um, so again, standard. Anybody with good, um, anybody with good nationality is good value. So Pazea here, uh, 82 for 10k. Uh, quite happy, quite happy with him. Uh, Cazola, he's an 84 and he's Spanish. So 14, 14k for those. Didn't mind them. Also. One to, ones to watch are just going out of packs. Now it's a international break for the next week. Uh, so you probably have to wait, we'll have to wait two weeks to make some money back, please. But things like uh, Joe Linton at 10k and Icardi, who's an 85 at 25k, um, quite happy. We'll hold him and then hopefully come, hopefully, um, come two weeks' time uh, when PSG are playing again. Uh, we'll pretty much be uh, there. And again, Sani, another 82. Quite high rated. Hopefully, some SBCs come along that require them. 
um, and we'll look to sell them in a couple of weeks. Uh, so in terms of sales for this week, we're going to we'll stick some things up to for sale uh, when Thursday comes around. Uh, but at the moment, it'll just be our uh, it'll just be our informs that we've got. Uh, so I've got a couple of Doherty's and a couple of Cresswells. Um, so we'll keep an eye, keep an eye on the price of these. And if these gone up about thirty percent, then we'll sell them. Um, be bad, though. Yeah, no. bit of time. Give it a week, so or give it Thursday. Hopefully the market flies, and then we can sell it then. Uh, but yeah, so that's it for today, guys. And I'll catch you next week. Um, keep an eye out for the Friday and see what happens. Um, and yeah, catch you next Monday in a bit.